The GCE is the more conventional military operations like offense, defense, the boots on the ground type stuff uh, that we're more akin to with standard military operations. Our main purpose in the MU is twofold, both the crisis response ability as well as testing a lot of the key concepts and abilities that the Commandant has laid out in Force Design 2030, and it starts with the ground combat element. My name is 2nd Lieutenant Vince Everman, and I'm a Rifle Platoon Commander for Charlie Company. At the MEW level, the ground combat element is the battalion landing team, which consists of an infantry battalion, which has three rifle companies, a weapons company, and a headquarters and services company. We have the ability to do a wide variety of missions. We can do anything from raids, assaults, to security for a refueling point, or an embassy reinforcement, or an airfield seizure, or a non-combatant evacuation while at the same time maintaining those more traditional military capabilities such as seizing an objective by fire and maneuver, as well as the traditional um, security operations. We have an engineer platoon, we have an artillery battery, including a high Mars platoon, as well as a light armor reconnaissance company, as well as some other key enablers such as EOD, and snipers and things like that. We work along with the rest of the components of the MU to conduct any and every operation. If we're taking aircraft, if we have air support, we need to coordinate with the planners from the aviation combat element. Eventually, we're gonna need some logistical requirements once we get ashore, and that comes in the form of logistics combat element counterparts. We need certain things in order to maintain our combat power and maintain our combat effectiveness. We will be forward postured in the world so that if a disaster hits, we along with the rest of the MU will be able to provide the assistance and the disaster relief that certain areas of the world might need. With the variety of capabilities that each component of the ground combat element brings, we have the ability to do anything, anytime, anywhere, regardless of enemy presence. Whether it's in the jungles, or in the deserts, or in the mountains, we practice all of our skills on a regular basis, from the riflemen all the way up to the company commanders, so that when the time comes, rather than if the time comes, we know that we're ready to do what the MU commander asks of us and what the American people ask of us.